getting on well, okay? Um, at least I want to beg you. Try as much as you can, at least to pay me half of my money for me. And uh, my, my goods are finished and I need to buy more. Please, try for me, at least in the next two market days, okay? I will, thank you. Good. You have rendered so much assistance to me. It will be very bad of me not to reciprocate that, even though I don't know how the miracle will happen, but I will try my best not to disappoint you. Thank you very much. Thank you. I will be on my way now. Okay. It's all right. As I'm talking to you now, I don't have anything in the house. There is nothing. All my debtors are on my neck. The worst part being that I can't even feed my daughter. I can't take care of her. The gods have abandoned me. They have turned their backs on me. I'm confused. No, Uncle. Don't sound like that. Maybe it's just this season. No, it is not. All my mates go into the forest and make good kills. But me, Aneke, the greatest hunter in Omunze, I have run out of fever. Why? I don't know what is wrong with me. I don't know what I have done to the gods that they treat me this way. No, no, uncle, please. I don't put it upon yourself. Such is life. It is not always straight. Just take it as one of those moments that prepare you for a better future. Hmm. Meanwhile, you have me and my brother. Our late parents left us with so many wealth, lands and cash crop. Hmm? I thought you that you went through all this without letting us know. My late sister did not die because of lack of money. But the gods decided it was time to take her away. All the same is okay. We will help you. We will help you clear up all the debts. No, 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 don't worry about that, please. I won't have you bother yourself over my issues. I am a man. I can take care of my problems. Aneke, wait. Oh? We are part of this family. Allow us to help you. I don't, I don't know. You, 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 you can't come into my problem. I'm just telling you because I felt like I, I would take care of it. Don't worry. Aneke, calm down. Your problems are our problems. Hmm? Let's help you. How much is the money? Still here? <laughs> you don't expect me to go just like that and leave you people here. I mean, who will be doing the cooking and other things? I mean, I need to spend some days with you and my niece until you begin to get used to being alone without the help of a mother. This is very thoughtful of you. You're so kind. Thank you very much. <laughs> don't mention. Where are you going to? I want to go check up on my friends and pay my debts. All thanks to you. That's nothing, don't mention. It's all good. By the time you'll be back, the food will be ready. Oh, okay. Thank you. Uh -huh. uh, where is that one? I haven't seen her. Maybe she's playing with other kids out there. Oh, okay. I'm glad she's actually becoming happy. I hope she keeps up with it. That way, she makes it easier for me to forget the demise of my late wife. Me too. You know she's now my mother as well as my wife. 
Let me run along. Yeah? I'll see you when I get back. All right. Good day, Auntie. Good day, Wyoma. Please, I'm looking for Adane. Oh, she's inside. Should I go and call her? Okay, don't worry. Let me meet her there. Auntie, I like your hair. Oh. Really? Like my hair? Auntie, please don't forget. Oh, sorry, you're good. Sorry, sorry. You like my hair? Oh, I like yours too. I know. You're very beautiful. Uh, I know. That's why Inam calls me Akuko. <laughs> You're very funny. What did you say your name is again? Akuko. And you, what is your name? My name? Hmm. What an interesting girl. All right. My name is Ugoma. We have Ugo in our names. Yes. Ugo and Ugo. <laughs> Doesn't make us friends. Of course. Friendship. I like you. <laughs> okay. Thank you. I've been chatting with this amazing kid. Who is she? She's my niece. Eh? 
Um, let me offer you. Okay, please don't, don't spoil her game. Let's follow this side. Sorry. Yes, so that's your niece. Hmm. Your late sister's daughter. Yes, so her name is Akuko. Yes, she told me. She's such an interesting girl. I like her. <laughs> Akugo is a girl loved by all. She's very intelligent and respectful. Yes. You can see how she was asking me. Auntie, what's your name? <laughs> oh, she did? Yes. <laughs> hey, Chai. Your late sister had such a lovely girl. one. <sighs> And that won't just allow her mother to watch her grow. Bikobal, what should I offer you? Anything. Just mention it. Anything. Anything. Okay, I'm coming. Mm -hmm. No, Papa, Papa. Auntie, this year friend is very beautiful. Beautiful, Kwa? No, I don't think she's beautiful. Auntie, don't tell me you cannot see it, so she's very beautiful. But they don't mind her. She can see it. She's just jealous of me. You wish. <laughs> Come, my you wish. Come, take. Share with me. No, it's all yours. Nam said that it's not good to share one's guest cooler. But I'm your friend. I told you that earlier. Please share with me, my friend. Please. Go ahead, take. She's your friend. Come sit with me. Mm. Your new friend. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Ah. <laughs> I can't believe you finished this food just now. This food is delicious. <laughs> you cook just like your sister. I never knew you were such a wonderful cook. Uncle, please stop. You flatter me when you compare me with my sister. I know my sister. She was the best cook I've ever seen. Mm. You cook exactly like her. Let me tell you something. Eh? Your husband will be a lucky man because he will go crazy with your cooking. No, no. You can leave me. You know how to make someone's head sweat. Mm. No. Oh. No. Mm? Adam. Look at this. My friend Auntie Goma gave it to me. Auntie Goma? Who is she? She's my friend. She came visiting earlier. They quickly became friends at first sight. She said she likes Akugo very much. And you never told me you had a friend in my village. Oh. Ah. I have oh. Goma. Mm. Okay, I met her the period my sister and I used to visit you before you people became a couple. Her mother hails from my village and she always frequented to me. She's a very good and decent girl. Ha, okay, I see. And you already made friends with her. <laughs> okay, wait. Okay, take back your crowns and go and keep them safe. Okay? Okay. And look.
This is Unam. I'm sure you know him. Good day, Mazi. You're welcome, my dear. You must be the friend she always talks about. Really? Yes. I don't know how she got so attached to you. Well, we like ourselves. And we have this common thing in our names. My name is Ugoma, and she's a Kugo. Ugo and Ugo. <laughs> oh, I see. <laughs> Good. Uh, please, I'm here to see uh, Ada Neshi around. Uh, no, Ada is not around. She went to her village to see her brother. But she promised to come back before evening, so I'm sure she should be on her way by now. You, you, can, wait, you can wait for her. No, I won't. No, please wait for her. I, sh I have some moonlight foxes to tell you. And I'll tell you after I'm done with the game. <laughs> so you're waiting, that's it. Okay, Omalitam, carry on with your game while I go to the farm and pick up something. I'll be back immediately. So what did you do to my daughter that got her this attached to you on your first visit? <laughs> like I told you before, we just like ourselves and do good thing I told you about. Oh yeah, you said that before. Ugoma <laughs> Akogo. So it was easy. You know, Ada had told me about you, but I I really don't know you. Okay. Um Dika Chebe's daughter from Obaha clan. Dikachebe. Oops, Dikach. Wait, no. Um, 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 um. Okay, Kezala, brother. Yes. Ah, ah, ah. I grew up with my grandmother, so most people don't know me. So Dikachebe has a daughter this big? Hmm. Yes. Um. Mazi, I heard you lost your wife recently. Yes. Death took away the only precious woman in my life. Ever since then, I've not been able to get over it. I've not been myself. I am trying to cope and see how I can um, survive without her. Mazi, please take heart. I believe the gods know what you're passing through and have plans for you. Do not be disheartened. The downfall of a man, they say, is not the end of his life. You just need to keep up the faith and believe for a better tomorrow. Once again, I'm sorry for the loss of your loved one. Thank you very much. I appreciate it. Hmm. You do not tell me sorry. Oh, my friend. I'm sorry. Yeah? Sorry, sorry. Okay, since this is your first time of meeting me in my house, I have to run around and get you something. I'll be back. Thank you, Mazi. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Let me tell you the folk tales that Mary used to tell me. Yes. There was this word that she told me that there was this word that I had in my wife. Has two words actually. Ada, you haven't gone to bed? No. And you, what are you busy thinking about? Uh, uh, no, no, nothing. I'm, I'm good. Don't bother. I'm okay. Are you sure? Yes, I am. 
Are you sure it has nothing to do with the meeting you had with your uncle today? I heard he summoned you at his place. Yes, he did. Tell me, why did he summon you? I don't just get it. That man is pestering my life. Imagine him trying to force me into getting another wife. I am happy the way I am. I don't know why people don't want to understand this. Nah, Kugo. Your uncle is very right. Yes. You are the only surviving son of your late parents. And my sister was unable to give you a male child before she passed on. So you need to get yourself another woman to bear your children. Ada. You amaze me. Well, I have a suggestion. Uh, what is it? Mm -hmm. I suggest you consider my friend Ugoma. She's the right woman for you. She's a very good girl. And she's that type of woman you need for a support at this trial time of your life. She is everything every man craves for in a woman. Adani, you are advising me to marry your friend? Yes, because I know she's the right woman for you. Ugoma is that type of woman that will not come to tear your family apart, but help you organize it and make it more of a home for you. Kachifo. I will advise him to take another woman. Someone that will take proper care of his child. You know, men, they are hardly at home. They don't know how to raise kids. Oh. I already told him to listen to his uncle. Some uncles won't even care. Sadly. Nem. The truth is that I mentioned you to him. I don't understand. You did what? I'm telling you the truth. I told him about you. Ugo, Aneke is a good man. The daughter loves you so much. And you are my friend. So? So? Please, please, please! If this is a joke, end it now, immediately! Tap on manya! You, 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 you want me, Ugoma? Hey! I cannot be a second wife to anybody. Mbam! Ugo, you are going too far. Eh? The wife my sister is late. There is no second wife in this issue. Ugo. Ugoma. Are we quarreling? Yes, we are. Why will you mention me to him without discussing it with me first? In fact, I'm leaving. Ugo, no, no. Ugo, come back. Ugo! Ugo! Maybe I was playing with you to see how you react. I know Ada very well. She was not playing with it. Even if she's serious, I think it's because of your closeness to her family. And then the little girl, you just told me about her some days ago. So I don't see anything wrong with it. Eh? It's just a matter of choice. That the man's uncle wants him to get married. And Ada suggested you. Why is that a problem? Or don't you like the man? Okay. You are the worst person to tell anything. You can continue with the food. <laughs> bye, 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 bye. I can't do ma. Good morning. Good morning. Welcome. How are you? Fine. Good morning. Good morning. 
Ishino Takugo. Hey! Umali Chaunwa. Biko, where is Goma? She's still sleeping. Eh? Hmm. Biko, go and tell her that I'm here with Takugo. Wake her up. Please, I don't have Goma's strength. She doesn't like it when you wake her up in between her sleep. Hey! I can't believe Goma is still sleeping. Go and wake Goma up. I will go there and wake her up myself. Yes. Ah. Auntie, don't worry. Don't go and wake her up. She will not be angry. <laughs> okay. I'm waiting. I don't walk up. Eh, Goma. Your mates are returning from the farm and you are still here sleeping. You should be ashamed of yourself. Ada, please, I don't want to trouble this man. <laughs> Auntie Ugoma, is it true that you and my auntie are fighting? Don't mind her. She's lying. <laughs> auntie Ugoma, I cooked jollof rice for you. Are you serious? <laughs> okay, tell me. Did you prepare the jollof rice yourself or your auntie here? Prepared it. Say the truth. I prepared it myself. Eh? Okay, let me ask you again. Did you prepare the jollof rice specially for me or for everybody? <laughs> for you. Really? <clears throat> thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank oh, you. That's nice. It's not easy to cook for a friend. Akugo, please can you tell Ekede my hair to mind that business? Please. Remove your mouth. <laughs> hey, let's go. <laughs> what is boy in Bian? My best friend. <laughs> Yeah, I'm just waking up. Uh, let me take my bath. I'm coming. Just go. I'll join you. What are you still waiting for? Eh? Go and eat your jollof rice. And stop for me. Mm -mm, I want to wait for you. Hey. Uh, uh, Akugo. She says she's coming to the house. Okay, you just wait behind. When she's coming, you people will come together. Oh, okay. let me run along. Mm -hmm. One. Okay. Let me talk. Bye. All right. Okay, let me go inside and take my bag. I'm coming. Where did you find your friend? I went to her house this morning. I see. Mazi, good afternoon. Good afternoon, my dear. How are you doing? Fine, thank you. Um, where is Ada? Um, Ada went out. She went out. She went out? Yes. Well, she came to my house this morning with her cook and she said she'll be waiting for us here. Ah. In that case, maybe she branched off somewhere else. But, but can't you wait for her? Yes, she waits. I have something for her. Yes, she has something for me. You and this your friend. Anyway, you can stay and wait. Uh, let me go and see my uncle. I'll be back soon. Okay. You see, I can wipe my waist. You say a lie. You can't do it. Me? Yes. You. <laughs> <laughs> but I can do it better than you. If you can do it better, why don't you stand up and do it? At least I did now. Okay, watch me. Yeah? Watch me. See? 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 Hey, hey. <laughs> Look at these two friends. Are we doing shaking competition? <laughs> why haven't you given your friend the food? Um, Auntie Ada, I didn't see you when we came back. That has not answered my question. You, where are you coming back from? You told us you'd be here waiting for us. Where did you go? I went to see Ogechukuo. Auntie Ada, please, can you go and bring the food? Are you serious? Is it not your food? Please, go and bring the food. Listen, Akugo, if you don't want to give me the food you promised me, I'll go. Please don't go. Let me go and bring it. <laughs> Aneke, I asked to see you in respect of our last discussion. 
How far have you gone? Have you found the woman? <laughs> Uncle, you are really going to put a rope to my neck if I don't get married again. Uh, hey, Machapo. Anyway, my sister-in-law had suggested a maiden to me. Though I'm yet to talk with her. Is she okay? Yes. Uh, if your sister-in-law introduced the maiden to you, that means she knows her very well. Who could that be? Do I know her? Mm, you might know her. Her name is Ugoma. Daughter of Mazi DK of Obaha village. Ugoma. Your sister-in-law's friend? Exactly. <laughs> She's a very good girl. And she's from a good lineage. Good. See, that meeting is exactly what you need. Like I said before, she's a very nice girl. And the best behaved of all the maidens in this land. Wow. But uh, my question is, do you really love her? Do you love her? Yeah, the Wagoma. No, she's my baby. What's that? <laughs> Let her not get used to this one. Mm -hmm. Leave her yeah. for me. Don't worry. Mm -hmm. You have She's me She's jealous. <laughs> and look at you. You're smiling. Enjoyment. <laughs> ah. Where are you all going at this time? <laughs> Uncle, we want to see Ugoma up. She says she wants to get something at Ore Market. Ugoma, isn't it too early to go to Ore Market? The truth is that if I don't go, I might not see what to buy. Don't worry, I'll come back tomorrow. I'm going to follow her until you go to the market. Did you not hear her say she will come back tomorrow? Eh, I will sleep with her. I'll come back tomorrow. <laughs> Ugoma, what have you given to my daughter? <laughs> she doesn't even care about me anymore. <laughs> I didn't give her anything. Uh, I'll go. Don't worry, Ori is far. Like I promise, I'll come tomorrow and see you. Hmm? That's all. What will I buy for you? Um. Karadioko. Mm. Isigi <laughs> Don't mind her. I'll buy a karadioko for you. Ada, please take Akugo back to the house while I see Goma. She's now my friend, isn't she? Of course. And then me. Ugoma. Uncle, please see how very well. Let's go. <laughs> I really don't understand. You, you don't understand that you have eaten deep into my daughter's heart. You don't understand that you have become part of my family. You don't understand that I love you so much. I know I was married before. And I lost her. I want you to come and be a good mother to a Hugo man. And I promise you this day I will do everything within my past to take care of you. I, I I want to rush to the market. She said she was running late for the market and hurried off. I, I don't know. I, I just hope the gods touch her heart. <laughs> don't worry, she will agree. For the fact she loves her Kuku, I know she will agree. Eh, I hope so. I Meanwhile, I'm hungry. Please get me food. Ugoma. Ugoma. What are you thinking? Thinking me? No, I'm not thinking. Why do you ask? 
I'm no more a child. And I know it when something is bothering you. My advice to you is to make a decision. That man is still young. And from what I've seen, you've become part of that family. If you like him, marry him. If not for anything, at least for the sake of that young girl that took her time to prepare jollof rice for you. My sister, you want to understand. But I do. Aneke is the most outstanding hunter. We know. Maybe you don't know him because you're not always here with us. But I do. If Papa is alive today, he will advise you to marry him. So think about it. I won't even give you a bad advice. She's not inside. What? Where has she gone to? Okay, maybe she's at the back. Follow me. Okay. <laughs> Mirizo wawa konwa neti Inine Ewo Ne mwando inine Ewo Ne mwando inine Uwa motank Ay But you said that Kugo is not feeling very fine Hell Hey Who said that one? I'm very fine as you can see I took over Please come and help us pick. Ada, please take Aku go into the hut. I want to have a word to go, man. Ada. Ada, why did you do this? Do you know I almost felt that when I was running down to this place? Sorry. Thank the gods you did not fall. Fire, man. Mwila <laughs> Mbada. I'll see you soon, okay? Sorry, I was the one who tricked you into coming. Because I want us to conclude our discussion so I will know when to come and see your home now. What are we concluding? Ugo, stop pretending like you don't know what I'm talking about. Stop acting strange. Please accept my proposal. Oh, no, no. I need to discuss it with my friend Ada. I am the one making the proposal, not Ada. Ne biko ono no, biko ono no, biko ono no. Let me see Ada, my friend. Good news. You are the daughter of your father. Thank you, Uncle. Come like. <laughs> in fact, if I was still in your age bracket, I would go for her. Sometimes uh, I, I just wonder how cruel life can be to some people. How? The way Dicky died in this community. He was a very good man. Sometimes in the community meetings, he will stand up and talk to Dicky anyhow he likes. Especially when they are not doing the right thing. Serious. Who doesn't know Dicky in this community? He was a very good man. Your age mates know him when he was weak. Anyway, that's by the way. In two market days, get ready. 
we are going to pay her bread price. Because another man who saw her too. And not the only person. Ha. Thank you very much, Uncle. Thank you. <laughs> well, you see, uh, the truth is that um, I like Ugomo. Yes, I like her and I, I believe she will make a good wife. And that was the reason I tried my possible best to make her agree. You did what? Uh, uh, am I not the one that initiated the movement? And I finished it. You only talked to her to come. Wait for Ziku. Okay, D. Mm -hmm. Okay. It's okay, it's okay, it's okay. See, both of you tried. Both the initiator and the executor. No, 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 no. Me. <laughs> hey. So, um, in two market days, we are going to bring Ogoma Nemona in this house. Yes, I will be the very person to carry the keg of power wine. See, tell those your king, kingsmen not to near that keg. Eh. Yeah. That will be my work. Karen. Karen the no problem. You And the mango, you won't test it. Madelika. Okay, the mango. <laughs> <laughs> I'm about to marry my friend. Let the marriage be a good one. The gods and the water spirits, please let it be a fruitful one. I beg of you. She could not give birth, so she went to this place and she adopted a child, and she stayed there for two months. So that you be like she gave birth there, yeah. and then she now went home, and then she was now like, oh, this is my baby. And then the husband believed her. <laughs> it's me, it's me, I won't believe her. Oh. The woman is so desperate. Mother and daughter. This one you are discussing. I hope this food does not suffer for it. No. Go back. Yes. Did you catch any me today? Of course I did. Okay, you're welcome. We are talking about the food. Does it matter if it tastes awful? You must eat it. You lie. If it tastes awful, I will not eat it. Nam, you must eat it all. Just pray that it tastes good. It is you who should pray it tastes good. <laughs> My husband, don't worry. I'm making a very delicious meal for you. 
trust me, your daughter can attest to that. Exactly, Inna. You know, I will make sure that your stomach is well fed. I trust you, my daughter. <laughs> anyway, I want to go into the hut and drop the gun. Okay. Yes. Mm. Akugo is coming to fetch you betting water. Oh, good. I'll be waiting. I'll go for no bookies. Where are you coming from? No, I'm not. I just went for a stroll. To Jeke River. What did you go there to do? Olachi told me that she saw you there. Olachi? But I did not see her. So, where is the water you fetched? I didn't go there to fetch water. Then what took you there? Nothing. I just went to relax. Anyway, go to the kitchen and take care of the food I have on fire. Hmm? Let me go to my mom Lachi's house. I'll be back soon. Why the food I asked you to look after is here burning? No, sir, let me bring it down. It's already down. Of course it is. But everything has completely burnt. What is wrong with you, Akuko? Eh? What is wrong with you? A child like you, why? How could you slip off just like that? Then I don't have any problem. It's just that I was tired and I slept off. And I just apologized. You just apologized? Eh? You just apologized. to a human being. What are you doing here?
You are shaking your head. If that pot breaks, eh, I will skin you alive. Hey, you're welcome. Your food is ready. Hmm? Do you want to eat now before you go again or after the next one? That my husband you Said I'm sorry. See, you regret hitting me today.
does it mean that Akuga has not eaten anything till now? Yeah, I guess she's still angry with me. Why are you bent on tormenting your stepmother? Do you think I'll ever forgive you if anything happens to her? No, I don't know what you're talking about. I will slap that evil spirit out of you if you pretend you don't know what I'm talking now, about. What do you think you want to do, Aniki? Eh? What is it? Stop accusing this innocent girl. What is that, sir? Ada, shut up! She knows what she's doing! She knows nothing! It is your foolishness that is all over you. What? Eh, 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 eh. Hold it, sir. I will not have you come into my house to insult my husband. Mba, tell him, that's not again. How dare you talk to my sister in that manner? H has you lost it? And what will you do? Eh? I'm asking you, Doka. What will you do? Mua. Yes. Ugomba, Ugomba, tell him. Uh, is it my brother you're talking to like that? Yes! He's the one I'm talking to. Obisi Nabo. And look at you. You're not ashamed of yourself. Eh? You think you're getting any younger? You're an old woman. Go and marry. I'm in my husband's house. Go and marry! Marry Ada, face your own family. Stop coming here to insult me and my husband because of this, your sister's witch of a daughter. Ow! Oh! Hey, slap her again! Slap her, slap her very well! You are here to You tell her to slap my wife, of course, in my compound? Yes, slap her! Come here to fight me! And what will you have come here to fight me? What will you do it for me? Don't try me! If you try me, I, 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 I will kill you and bury you right in this compound! Bagger it! You have stayed back! Come back here! Why are you running? I thought you came to find me my company. Yes! Come back! Come back! Get out of here! 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 Get out of
Come here. Come here. Come here. Come here. Come here. Come Serves her right. Anakin. Look at her eyes. Ah. I regret giving back to you. Anakin! Hey! 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 Initiated her marriage to my in law. Tell me, what crime did I commit? What crime did I commit? Just look at what they have done to a girl. Her mother died and left lonely. Just they go there. You mean Aneke and Gom Goma did this to this girl? Mm -mm, I did it myself. Oh, Mumeliaya! This will not end like this. Your sister and her husband will explain to Agbara the meaning of Ogbanji. All the ROC in this community will come into this issue. One of her eyes is damaged. Who knows if she will ever see with it again. The gods of our land will not allow that teaching. You see, but... Hmm. Ada, Ugoma is your friend. 
Aleke is your in-law. Please, let's take this issue calmly and find out the truth. I can't believe this is happening. I've told my sister to be sure of what she's saying. I can't believe Goma and Akugo is doing this. But the gods of our land will not allow anybody behind this to go free. It's your sister who is behind it. Just look at what they did to a girl. Her mother died and left lonely. What does she know? We all Very well. Eh? Well, I blame death. I blame death that killed my sister. If she was alive, tell me who will call her innocent child and Obanjo. Okay, then we Ada, wipe your tears. Even if she's an Obanji, is it not human beings that are sometimes possessed with the water spirits? Oh. But I know that Ugo might hates Akugo and wants to throw her out. Because if Akugo is her daughter, she will never treat her like this. I will get to the root of this. Simple. Please, I'm sorry. Oh, God, I'm very sorry. You're shivering. Why should I shiver? Oh, you have no reason to shiver. That means you feel no remorse for what you did to that little innocent girl. Fine, I will make you feel exactly the same way she felt that day. Eh? Don't touch me, oh! Don't touch me! You idiot! Fool! I will deal with you! I'm the god who made your feet to hit you! Be all right. She just had a knockout. Are you sure she's still alive? Of course. She's alive. You can see her breathing. She'll be alright. I just hope this is not what I'm suspecting. Because if it is.
Odoka. What did I hear you say? Are you insane or something? You beat up Ugoma and her unborn child. Hey? Eh? Uncle, I'm regretting the whole thing. Yes! The point is not that I beat her. The point is that she's still alive. Chineke, yes! Can you hear yourself? Yeah, Udoka. You better be thankful to the gods that she did not die. And hope nothing has happened to her unborn child. Otherwise, I doubt if you'll be standing here spitting that nonsense. Oh, I'm surprised at these things you're seeing. Yes! I'm surprised you're sounding like this. Why are you blaming me? Yeah, that, why, why, why is Uncle blaming me? I'm surprised too. Did you see what the, she, she and her husband did to Akugo? Uh, Uncle, hmm? exactly. She deserved whatever Udoka did to her. Oh, keep quiet, you. Killing her with that solve the problem. It's me. It only aggravate things. Your people should be thankful. And let this be the last time such madness will ever happen. Uncle, and that should also be the last time they will cheat her in that manner. Yeah. She's not a one that they beat anyhow. Udoka. Oh, now. Uh, Ada. The dream again? Yes. This time around, it's worse. She almost strangled me to death. Did you see Akugo's face? Not really. But I'm sure she's the one. I'm sure you. Since her face was not made visible to you, how can you prove she's the one? I know Akugo very well. I can recognize her no matter the form she appears in. Can you get me any of our clothes?
Go and get me a plantain leaf. Not an Obanji. She has nothing whatsoever to do with the water spirits. I did not see anything wrong in this compound. I only see a visitor tormenting the wrong person. A visitor tormenting the wrong person? Yes. Go and get me your hunting gun. I saw you hunting. You shot somebody. A little girl that went to fetch firewood. Who? Oh, an innocent girl. Hmm. No. I can't remember any such incident. Is that the reason for what's happening with my wife? Think first. Maybe you will remember. got married to my first wife. You are right. Could she be behind everything happening in this compound? Yes. She had to wait till your daughter has come of her age. So you can bear the pains of killing someone's daughter. That little girl you killed almost decayed. Till her parents found her. 
all this you are experiencing is because our spirit is not at rest. What do I do? Please tell us, what do we do now? Because already my daughter has been accused wrongly and I have inflicted so much injury on her. You have to find her parents and render sincere apology to them. What you committed was a very sinful act. I just pray they forgive you. Ah, Julika! Ah, Julika! The great seer of our time. The only Gibia who has seen what was covered with the mother. Ah, Julika! Hmm. The only Gibia whose father gave the offer until this day, the offer had been leading you. Ah, Julika, I greet you. I greet you too, Ije Onoji. I was actually going to your shrine. My shrine? I hope all is well. This is my granddaughter. She's been accused of being an Obanji. Please, can, can you follow me to the house? I want to be sure to, if she's one or not. Please. Uh, my, my brother's uh, daughter's child, the one uh, who, who, who lost her mother uh, a few years ago. Oh. You mean the one that is married to Ichi of for the lace brother's son? Yes, 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 yes. Mm. Go back home. What? I was just coming back from there. Eh? Yes. It was the father that breaks the rotten egg that is smelling in his household. Yes. The little girl he killed has come to revenge. What? So go back home and rest. So my my granddaughter is not an Obanji. Hey! In that case, we have to locate the girl's parents and ask for their forgiveness if they will. That is the problem, Uncle. I don't even know this girl. I, I, I don't know her parents or anything about her. I just found out I had shot her in the bush. I went closer and noticed she was dead. Then I took to my heels. Ever since then, I've not set my feet in that forest again. But you still remember the forest? Yes, that was um, a Banese forest. It belongs to Umwe Zinola community. Good. In that case, we have to go to Umwe Zinolo and ask questions about a little girl that was shot in the forest of Ebanese some years back. But Uncle, I, I can't still believe I'm responsible for everything happening in my household. Okay, friend. I always tell you to look before you leave, but you wouldn't listen. Just calm down. Uncle, mm -hmm. so Aneke is actually the cause of all this. That is what the Dibia told me. Hey! I said it! I said it that Akugo is innocent. Hey! Now that she's in pain, what they will say to her is just sorry, Okuya. Okuya, do gaga and see her. Hey! I wanted to take her with me, but her father refused. I see if I saw all this coming. I look forward to this to that innocent girl. I'm naked. Yeah. I'm naked. What are you doing? What 
are you both doing here? Will you leave now? Leave! Iche! Udoka! Please come. Here. What do you want here? Did you miss your way or something? Iche. I don't know where to start. Don't start from anywhere. You have no explanation whatsoever to make. Forgive me, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, please. Adam, Makugo, I am your father and I understand how you feel. <laughs> please forgive us. I promise you a thing like this will never happen again. Please, it's okay. I'm sorry, please. Leave me. Where are you? Oh, no. Oh, you have the audacity to come into my car. for the home of a girl who was killed in the forest a few years ago. We know it's this village, but we don't know the exact place. Huh. The one I know is if anyone that died when fresh and fire would have run in this forest. Yes, that, that's the person. Okay, the first building by your right, House of Okereke's house. On this road? Yes. Thank you, thank you very much. the girl in the bush and it was the spirit of the girl that is doing all of this and not even Akugo. My sister, that is the truth. The Ezemo was here himself and he opened up on how everything happened. Mm -hmm. <sighs> but why is the spirit not even attacking Aneke? Oh, that is what I've been thinking about ever since this was revealed. My sister, I'm having the thought that is the same spirit that killed his first wife. Why do you think so? Because he was not yet married before the thing happened.
Oye, no. ¿Dónde voy a ir? ¿Dónde voy a ir? ¿Dónde voy a ir? ¿Dónde voy a ir? ¿Quién eres? Yo soy el chico para el día. Y este es Aneke, mi hermano. Estamos buscando a Mazo Kereke. ¿Estamos en el lugar? Sí. Esta es Mazo Kereke's house. Please, you want to see him. Okay. Sit down. Let me call him. Papa? Papa? I am a cheer for dinner. And this is Aneke, my nephew. Okay. Um, we come to seek for something very important. If only you can give us audience. Uh, go ahead. Go ahead. Uh, as a matter of fact, what we have to see might be very hard for you to bear. <laughs> what are you saying? You are speaking in parable. You had a daughter that was shot in the forest of Ibanezi some years back. Yes. Yes, so many years ago, somebody shot my daughter and ran away. Mm. For three days, I looked for her. And finally, I found a decayed body in the bush. I met your hair. Ah! Who is at home? <laughs> Papa, what is it? Why are you shouting? One of these people killed the For so many years, you did not come to my house. Now you are in my house. What for? Why are you here? Tell me, why are you here? Who among you shot my sister? Who killed my sister? No, I'm sorry, I, I did. <laughs> Mazo Kereke, please calm down. Remember what I told you when we first came in here? <laughs> I told you this is an old one, but we can always handle it. Please, Nico. <laughs> there is no point. <laughs> there is no point. My daughter has started revenge, and that is why you are here. <laughs> My daughter is with a weapon to go after who killed her. Now, leave my house before I do something terrible, and I am serious about it. Get out from my house! Get out! Get out! Get out! Get out of my house! Oh, where, are, where are they? Get out! Ah! You killed my daughter. And you are here in my house. To do what? It's alright. Anyway, <clears throat> I will tell her uh, uh, to, to plate your hair for you. Hmm? Did you see your father and your auntie the other day they came here? Yes, Grandpa. And you noticed that your auntie was crying? Grandpa, I saw her crying, but she's the cause of all this. My father beat me because of her. Mm. You saw what I did to them? You brought out your gun and you chased them away. Mm -hmm. you, know, you have to forgive your father and your auntie. See, we went to Ezemo and he said that you are not an Obanji. And that your auntie is not an Obanji too. We have found out what the problem is. And your father is doing everything possible to solve the problem. It's, it's alright. It's alright. It's alright. Stop crying. It's alright. Your eye will soon heal. And your arm is almost healed too. Now take it gently, gently. It's alright. Gently. 
Please. You have to forgive your mother. And forgive your auntie too. Will you? Please. Hmm? Aneke, I will go back there myself. There's nobody who don't react the same way Okereke did. We are talking about human being. I will go and apologize to him. Uh, you don't have any business coming with me because the sight of you might get me irritated. Hoku, your idea is fine. Thank you very much. Please help me apologize to him. Tell him I, I shot his daughter in error. It wasn't my intention to kill his child. I will. Just relax. Eh? I will talk to him the way he will understand. Thank you. Let's go. Papa, you shouldn't have to forgive him. This thing happened a few years ago. And the person that ran away has finally come to see the family. You just have to forgive him, Papa. Please, beg of you. If not that I gave if you are something to go after whoever killed her, that boy will have come here to confess. Anyway, I'm going to invite you Muna into this issue. He has to tell me why he has to kill my daughter. No, Papa. You have to leave the Umuna out of this. Since Ifeinwa died, how many Umuna have come to ask you how to do her burial rites? My sister was buried like a fowl. Hey, Papa, what I'm saying is this, whenever they come again, tell them that the person they killed has not been properly buried. Let them bring money. Let's do small burial and you will call the Dibia and remove whatever you put in that coffee so that everybody will rest in peace and my sister will rest in peace too. Papa, please. I must tell you, it is wrong when people refuse to do things the right way. I am aware that uh, your nephew must have shot my daughter mistakenly. If he was dead, broke my heart and that of her mother. In fact, her mother died of the shock. Hmm. Okay, I am I am so sorry. I am so sorry. The deed has been done. What is the way forward? Well, uh, my daughter Ikode spoke to me about this issue. She's not at home now. She's, I sent her on an errand and she will soon be back. But uh, I must tell you, if you are has not been buried properly, I mean in terms of burial rights, so if we must talk about it, I mean, it's going to be on that angle. Yes, um, I understand you. If it is on that angle, we are ready to do it very, very well. All we ask for is for every one of us to bury the hatchet. Okay. Uh, I am going to discuss with my hormone now. And whatever conclusion we arrive at, I will let you know. That's very good. Thank you very much. Um, we are here to 
tender our sincere apology to your entire household. Ask on Ibu Niwe, Ilima Kisi. To err is human, and to forgive divine. Please, let this family come together in peace once again. So, Ugumba, my niece is not an Obanji finally. Ada, please forgive me, I'm sorry, please. Answer my question first. Ada, let's leave this issue. Everything should be in the past. My best friend, please, I'm sorry. Forgive me. You are my best friend. <coughs> my sister from another mother. Please, I'm sorry. Forgive me. I didn't know what I was doing. Please, I'm sorry. Please. Please. Look at my head. Will it be free again? Thank you. 
Good night.